nothing changes. Hey, what is up guys? Welcome here. Welcome back to an all new video. Today we are here back again with Sub Nautica. Last episode we looked around for Cave Sulfur a ton and tried to find other resources. We built the scanner and the repair tool. This time we're going to see some new objectives that we can get on in the game. Some things that we can get started on. I want to get right into this because we have a time limit. And I want to just get as much as I can for you guys in. So uh, let's load up our game. Whoo, this is going to be awesome. This game is so good, honestly. It just, it literally makes me excited to play, which is like pretty much every other game I have, but this one is just, oh, it's perfect. I'm really excited to get, get back into this game. Uh, there's so much to explore, and, um, let's just, let's get it on. And I was talking to my friend, he said, food and water are really big in this game, so I need to stock up on those. So I will do that, because that probably will be important. He's right. <laughs> Long loading screen. I probably should have talked during this, so now we're just sitting here. Awkward silence. Ready? Awkward silence. More awkward silence. Continued awkward silence. Alright, here we are. Yet again, the beautiful ocean graphics. Alright, so last episode we got the um, scanner and the repair tool. And, of course, I have my uh, fire extinguisher. So to start off, while I'm searching for things, I'm going to try to fa uh, get some more of the fish because they can make me more food and water. Ah! Uh, what are you? I'm going to scan you because it wants me to. Come here, boomerang. Indigenous life form. I'm almost going to grab you. Come here. All right. I got a boomerang. Is this metal salvage? Yes, it is. Creature egg. Don't need that. Uh, okay. Um... Let's just scan some stuff, figure out, get some, get some identification of these, the creep mines again. Ooh, I want to scan that, that coral. Creep vines, indigenous life form, brain coral, thank you for your delicious oxygen. Brain coral, I need, I'm pretty sure, those are the guys, what are they, bladderfish? They make uh, water, so we need, we need a bunch of these guys. Is there any more bladderfish around here? Yeah, there are, but they're too far away. All right, let's head back to the ship and figure out what we want to build next. Because right now, I'm pretty sure we can just scan, self-scan ourselves again. I don't know what else different we're gonna find. Normal. Back into the ship to make my food and water. Any radio messages? Nope. All right, fabricator. Uh, what can I make new? A power cell, high capacity mobile phone. Alright, cooked food. Cooked boomerang. And I think we can make the other guy into water. Yes, we can. Uh, let's see what tools we have to make. Uh, repair tool. Ooh, survival knife. Yes, I will have a survival knife. That sounds important. I think you should always have a knife in any. Um. Quantum detonation. The massacre of Abraxia Prime? That sounds terrible. And they removed weapons because of it, so, oh, that couldn't have been good. I'm gonna rearrange my uh, bar here. Survival life first, as I was saying, should be one of the most important things in a survival situation is a knife. Uh, we have a bunch of resources. Um, deployables. I can make a locker. I don't need a locker right now. I have plenty. I need a sea glide. That's what I need. So, uh, oh shoot, we were gonna look at these those um uh the big oh wait we already did uh the big big dudes right the big creatures did we want to look at those guys big creatures maybe no yes no we did did we ever go check those guys out. I guess we didn't. Oh, it's probably because I couldn't find them, but, um... Anyways, uh, so I need to find blueprints, I guess, for those things that said ingredients unknown. So I guess I can look around for some. I think we saw wreckage last episode, so let's try to find wreckage again, and, um... There might be things inside of it that are important. 
on the road again. Ooh, is this a, one of those volcano things? Ooh, there's more metal salvage. Those carry up way too much room, though, and there's so much of it that I'm fine. No, it's just a little pit. Hello, gasopod. Stay away from me. Oh, I know what your sacks do. Uh, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Uh, don't touch me. Alright, let's... Where art thou wreckage? Ooh, table coral. Is that wreckage? It is indeed wreckage. A lot of wreckage. Wow, okay, this is gonna do a lot of exploring. I hope there's things. They wouldn't put that there for no reason. Just for the aesthetic effect. Let's see what we can find on here. Uh, this looks like just a piece of metal. More pieces of metal. Oh, here we go. Is this a crate? Can I open you? Crate? Can't open the crate. Here's another crate. Hello, crate. Oh, ooh, what is that? Sea glad fragment. Sea glad. One out of two. Grab trap. Whatever just made a sound next to my ear actually scared me. What was that? Oh, it was the gas pods. Oh, sweet. I got a grav trap and a sea glad fragment. Don't know what a grav trap is. Like a gravity trap? Is that what they're trying to. What does that mean? What is that? Is that a message? Did I get a message? A message from what? Wait, I'm gonna go check out that last piece and then we'll head back. Did I get a... M that looks like my radio. Did I get a radio message? Hmm. From perhaps one of the other life pods? Ooh, more grab trap. I want more sea glide though. That sounds like something that will help me around the water. And then no more wreckage. Alright, I just... Ooh, that's pretty. I need more stuff for the sea glide. So hopefully we can find that. Did I get a radio message? You need water. And food. Okay, you're running low on water, but who cares? We did! Uh, play message. This is Life Pod 3, uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide. So if we're late to rendezvous, don't panic. Rendezvous. So what rendezvous? Down. Seriously. Three out. Dude! Signal. Life pod's alive. Okay, wait. Signal. Signal location. It's not gonna be in the data bank. Let me just get these over so they don't keep popping up. Uh, sh come on. Come on. Yes, wow. Amazing. Table coral. Okay, uh... Blueprints? Where is it? Where am I gonna find... I'm just getting these out of the way. Voice log... Okay, um, where am I going to beacon? Oh, right there. Signal iPod 3 and the Shallows crew reported their sea glide damage. Okay, they might have the other sea glide uh, things. Oh, can I change the color of it? Let's make it yellow. Yellow as an important. Okay, uh, beacon. Can I see it then? I can. Wait a minute. 237. Is that? That's not what I think it is. No, it's just that far away. All right, let's go get Life Pod 3. They don't want us to leave without us, then we will not. I thought I meant like 237 meters down. I was like, oh, not going to happen. <laughs> I've only been going like an average of 20 meters down this whole game. And it's all bright on now, so it'll be easier to see wreckage. Lots of metal salvage. I am never going to run out of titanium. Oh, dude, here's even more salvage right here. There's more of that grab trap, but I already discovered it, so what's it going to do now? Oh, it just turned into titanium, alright. Trash can. Can I just discard stuff, I guess, that I don't want? Don't have to, like, throw it into the ocean, like I've been doing this whole time. I don't need more titanium. Oh, please tell me that's sea glide. Oh, beacon fragment. Is there beacons in the game? One out of two. Beacons would be cool. You can, like, just put them down wherever you want. Like, oh... This is where this thing is. Uh, do I need to scan metal salvage, really? Oh, no. Okay, I think we have everything we need in terms of the grab trap. <laughs> Alright, I want to head to the life pod. We're not the only ones out here. Oh, there's one of those shark dudes. Can I scan you? Did I? S I can't remember if I scanned you or not. Stalker. Ah! Ah, stop chasing me, please! Ah. Mm. 
stalker. They're not gonna stalk me, are they? Cut creep vine with knife. Oh, sweet. Gave us a creep vine sample. Oh, we can eat it! Sweet! Free food, just tons of it. Hanging around. Alright, let's see what these guys want. Give me more food. Oh, oh. oh dude, here they are. Life pods. Oh, my goodness. Their pod did not remain buoyant and sank to the bottom of the ocean. What do we got here? Uh, abandoned PDA. They have a PDA. Uh, data box. What is that? Like a chip or something? Uh, a compass? I can make a compass. That's what I said I wanted. Oh, wait. I th okay, hold on. I'm going to get out of here before I bite the bullet. What is that? That looks like sea glide fragment. Oh, yes, please. Oh, yes, please, please, please be sea glide. It's a sea glide. New blueprint, sea glide. Oh, please tell me we can glide across the sea. As stupid as that sounds, I really want to. The Aurora's... I still want to go explore that place. Sweet! Oh my god, we got tons of new blueprints. Alright. We will check what those are, see what it's going to take to build those other things, and then we will wrap up the episode. Uh, bladderfish, can I grab you? No, you're too fast. Maybe if I had a sea glide, I could get you. <sighs> so much swimming. How can you do this much swimming? So much. I mean, uh, don't get me wrong, I love swimming, but this is exhausting. Just can't even sleep. Can I sleep? Because I feel like I need sleep. I've been awake for at least two days now without any sleep. Or coffee. Coffee would also be great. Alright, alright, let's see, let's check out our new things. Okay, uh, blueprints. What do we get? Trash can. Permanently deconstruct unwanted items to safely release our constitute atoms in the atmosphere. That'll be nice if we don't want to just, like, throw things down. Sea glide. Converts torque into thrust underwater via propeller. Oh, dude, we just get our own propeller, and that is not hard to make either. Except I don't know what lubricant is. We just need some resources for that. Pathfinder. Deploys holographic pathfinder discs used to map away back out of caves or hard to navigate spaces. Now, I might need that because I suck at navigating caves. Uh, what did that say? A compass! Displays compass heading on the HUD. Yes! Yes, please! Oh, I don't know how to make a wiring kit, but, uh, silver ore? I need to find silver. Fiber mesh with those creep vines. Oh, this is awesome! Okay, wait. Uh, Aurora Survivors, iPod 3 crew. That was the thing I picked up. Oh, we can play it? You really think it'll carry two of us? Your regular sea glide tows a mass of 80 kilograms at over 30 kilometers an hour. The power cell I reached at this one should double that. You think there's something out there that's faster? I'm sure. And that's assuming it doesn't overload three meters from the light pod. You're calm about this. I'm seeing the engineering problem. If I stop seeing the mass, I'll be terrified. So obviously, did they just like boogie out with the sea glide thinking they could carry two people? Hopefully they could. Carnivore. Streamline programming kind of the kelp forest. Stalker. T titanium deposits. Attracted titanium deposits. Okay, so it's attracted to um, assessment. Socrates may have activation in enameled, enameled glass. Ooh, getting fancy. Scattered wreckage. Uh, outer layers of material oxidized. 1,200 Celsius. Ouch. Okay, awesome. So we got a ton of new blueprints. I really want to build that sea glide next episode as well as a compass. That'll be that'll help us a lot. Both of those are going to help us a ton. But um, that's going to have to end it for this episode. I'll drink some more water. I'm running low on that. Going to have to collect more of that. But um, yeah, that's going to have to end it for this episode of Subnautica. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like and subscribe and join the wolf pack. And comment down below if you have any tips for me, any things I should be building, any things I should be checking out. We're going to do our daily self-scan really quick. Normal. Uh, I hope you guys had an amazing day, and as you know, Waterwolf out!